to begin with, I'd like each one of you to get a mini whiteboard, a marker, and an eraser from the basket. And you're going to do a quick brainstorming. This is part of our group synthesis process. In order to come up with the best answer in the group, capture as many ideas as you can that are related to this question on the mini whiteboard. No sentences are needed. You can put phrases, you can even put pictures. Group synthesis is a way of coming up with a response to a problem or a question that has been put forward where the entire group has to participate in formulating the best possible answer. Every person has to contribute. And what I like about it is that you start with that individual effort, that brainstorming that happens. There is no judgment, put down what you know about the subject, we talk it through. We always begin by having them respond individually to a question and then we move to the within group approach. Within your groups, remember, your discourse prompt card can help you talk through your ideas. Take turns, each person sharing from the group. If you disagree with somebody's input, you can challenge it. It's, it's like reverse back because the temperature is decreasing, so the gas... So the idea was to come up with the body of a paragraph that would respond to the question on what happens to a gas as you cool it down and change it from a liquid to a solid. The kinetic energy produced by molecules. You have shared your ideas in your small group. Now we'd like you to come up with a final answer using the erasable white strips that are at the table. There are four strips, one per person. You're able to see a student uh, back away from an idea that they had initially come up with because listening to the discussion, they realized, hmm, that didn't make so much sense. We're going to display our work on the cabinets for everybody to see so we can continue to the next phase where we're visually processing the material. Going back and rewriting that individual response that they had done without the benefit of the peer discussion becomes something intensely valuable. In my science classes, we have the students type their revised responses in a different color, and the, 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 the differences are then striking. Let's deal with all the number ones first, then we'll look at the number twos. What are the things that are common to all the first sentences? Like all the, like the temperature is decreasing. It was so yes. very easy to so realize that so as long as I did my planning properly and yeah. we got to the richest discussions possible, no, we could do away with all those extra worksheets that we had just been filling in, at practice over and over again. Now the talking, the discourse was pulling out all this rich information from students for the benefit of other students. We were worksheet queens. Now we're not, and I do feel that the students are achieving as much, if not more, in terms of their critical thinking and the growth in that area through the discourse. Decreases as they They can don't all vibrate. talk, they all have ideas. They, there's quality in every single group of students that we have. <laughs>